I was devastated. It was like a bombshell. Uh, not only was I to learn that I had uh, rectal cancer, while I was being prepared for the surgery, they found another tumour in my right groin. And it turned out to be malignant as well. So I had two cancers, uh, rectal cancer and testicular cancer. My name is Elil. I'm 59 years old. I was diagnosed with uh, both rectal and testicular cancer in 2011. I had one uh, patient call it a shit back life because of the stomach back that, you know, they have to wear the entire time. Uh, many of them go into uh, severe depression. Uh, some of them even contemplate suicide. A lot of helplessness. And they really, really cannot come to terms with it. The initial fear was always, what if there was a leakage? I had two major incidents. One was uh, when I was going back to my mother's place after uh, dinner. I was on a train and the bag was already starting to fill up. I got off at Tiong Baru MRT and I walked the short distance from the train station to my mother's place and the bag burst. So there I was walking along with uh, feces running down my body. Um, yeah, and it was quite a traumatic situation at that time because it was the first time it happened. And uh, yeah, it, it was a horrible feeling. The second time, it was a bit more uh, bearable because it happened in Malaysia. Uh, I was there uh, for a trip and um, it happened while I was sleeping and uh, the bed sheets all got soiled. Uh, because it came, uh, everything came out before I could reach the toilet. And these were two of the most, uh, I guess, embarrassing incidents. Okay, this product is from uh, Convertec. Two, two years ago, I was introduced to this product by uh, Audrey. The product looks like this, and there's this opening for your stoma, and then you can stretch it to, the size, to suit the size of your stoma. Now, as luck would have it, this is exactly the same size as my stoma, so I don't even have to stretch it. And being the lazy guy that I am, it was a perfect fit for me. Uh, when I put it on, it turtlenecks around my stoma, so there's a very really snug fit. And uh, as a result, uh, I never experienced any leakage when I was using the multiple product. And that did a world of difference for my confidence. No scissors, no cutting. And for me, that's perfect. Uh, I have a friend who is a bit down uh, because she has already had a surgery. So, um, Kelin, how have you been feeling lately? Although I feel good, but inside me, I don't feel that I'm whole anymore. Okay, you need to, to stay positive. You need to do things. Right, so get, get involved in something, do some exercise. So I do uh, dragon boating and kayaking. When you do things, then uh, you're able to, to overcome all this self-pity, all this depression and stuff like that. Um, I know it's easier said than done, but you must try. Go for some uh, activities with friends. Okay, um, I can understand uh, what they're going through because uh, I myself have been through two cancers uh, and I know how difficult it is to deal with it. To raise funds for the Singapore Cancer Society, we walked a total of a thousand kilometers across the Gobi Desert. I personally, for me, the motivation was uh, that I wanted to show the estimates out there that there is no limit to what you can do. Why don't you come down for my Zumba class this, this Monday evening? Uh, we have a group of survivors. Uh, we get together and there's an instructor. We meet a lot of uh, people who are going through the same thing. Uh, all of them have 
decided to, to stay positive and get on with life.